in this video, we're going to focus on factoring the trinomial negative 5x to the second minus 3x minus 14. I, when I first looked at this problem, I was like, oh, I do not like that minus in front there. <laughs> that, that really throws me off because we doesn't, we don't deal with that a lot. Okay. But that's all right. We're going to deal with it anyways. Now I want you to see, I'm going to use just a chart as an organization tool. You may have seen this chart before. Like I said, it just organizes the information. So I'm gonna put the squared term here. So you see that x to the second, that's the squared term. Then I'm gonna put the term without the variable, I'm gonna put it here. And then the one in the middle, I'm gonna put it down here. It's gonna be our check. Okay, so we start in the first column. We ask ourselves, okay, what two things are gonna to multiply to give me negative five x to the second? Well, that's gonna have to be negative 5x and x, or it could be positive 5x and negative x. I don't know, we're gonna have to play around with that a little bit. Then we look at the second column, we ask ourselves, okay, what times, what will multiply to give me 14? So that has to be seven and two, right? So I'm gonna put seven and two, by the way, think about it. You could flip flop that and put the two on top and the seven on the bottom. Now let's check it. And the way we check it is we multiply across. So negative five times, negative five X times two gives me negative 10 X. And then we multiply across here. So X times seven gives me seven X. And what has to happen in this last column is these two have to add to give you the bottom one. So seven X plus negative 10 X gives you negative three X that works. So I know that I have factored it correctly. So here's what we do. We take out of the rows. Notice the first row inside is a negative five X plus seven. And the second row is an X plus two. And it's factored. Okay. Now the chart again is just an organization tool. It doesn't do anything magical. <laughs> it just helps me organize all of the pieces that I need to factor. 